Welcome back to Night in the Woods. We've now done some research at the library and found a bunch of old stories that gave us three leads on how to continue investigating the ghostly happenings. So I'm assuming we're going to follow up on probably one of those leads today. Um, I can't remember if I looked at the messages on our computer at the end of the last episode, so let's check real quick. Uh, I don't think so. Dude, my mouth tastes weird this morning. Like a tire. I'll be at work trying to wash it out with whatever whatever's in the cooler. Away message. Planets are to be pitied as they cannot know how big and cool they are. Dr. Kathy Conklin, National Astronomy Agency. Last night inspired me. For... For longest night? What? What does that mean? For longest night, I'm getting you a library card. I don't understand what that means. I get, I get the library card part, but not what for longest night. You're welcome. Scientists. Rising sea levels will increase shark attack frequency for obvious reasons. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Do we have any new songs other than the one that we... Oh, wait a minute. TikTok. That's new. So yeah, Pumpkinhead Guy is the absolute catastrophe of a song that... Well, I mean, the song's not a catastrophe, but my performance of it was when we played it at band practice yesterday. But TikTok, we've never even played at all. Um, I wanted to try Pumpkinhead Guy, but honestly, it's so hard, I, I think it would take me more than... Much more than just a couple tries to get good at it. Uh, let me practice TikTok once, and then I'll come back and play it again when I'm a little bit better at it, because I've never played it before. Ah, yes, TikTok. That terrible charity barity song about telling time. Oh. Hmm. If it's like a little kid's song, maybe it'll be super easy to play. Punched up the lyrics a bit with Greg back in high school. Oh, never mind. It's been changed. Let's see if I can remember all the words. Okay, I'm definitely going to cut out that first attempt because, well, it was horrible. <laughs> it's actually a pretty hard song. I feel like the, uh, it seems like the further into the game you get, the songs seem to get harder. So even though it was originally like a children's song of some sort, uh, it's pretty damn difficult. And it's actually really fun to play, too. It's a cool melody for the bass. Um, my second attempt probably won't be super good, but still. Let's do it again. It's a pretty cool song. And by the way, I think I got the ability to play this song because of the fact that I looked at the Charity Barity thing in the library. So I think maybe exploring the world is actually what's opening up some of these songs. These these new songs, other than the ones that we get at band practice. So yet another reason to explore more of the world, because I freaking love playing these songs. Alright, I'm, again, I'm going to mess this up a lot. It's pretty hard. But it's not Pumpkinhead Guy hard.
is such a cool song. It's really fun to play. Yeah, there's definitely some parts that are really hard about it. But it's it's really fun to play. Such a nice melody. Charity Barity is a nightmarity. There's no point in going back in here, right? Nope. Can't examine the safe again or anything like that. Hey, bird. Sorry, I'm always rude to you. Yeah, you called him a trash bird earlier. Or shit bird or something. I think it was trash bird. Morning, sunshine. You feeling okay? You look a little limp. Yeah, uh, weird dreams. Weird night. You say weird a lot. Just being honest. You taking headache meds? They're in the bathroom cabinet. Yeah, I am. They're kind of working. Kind of not. Well, maybe you need more sleep? I mean, more than the ten hours or so you already get. You've always been my sleepy girl. Oof. What'd you do last night? Went to the library with B. That sounds nice. It was. Or, it was. Weird. Interesting. Okay, gotta go. Be safe, hon. Take it easy. You really do look a little tired. Getting out makes me feel better. Me too. Maybe it's a good day to get out in the fresh air. I'll let you know. Bye, sweetie. Sounds like today is not a rainy day. Yeah? Nice. Hey, wait a minute. The, the construction crew's gone. I can go to the right now? What's to the right? I'm scared. Where is this? What do I do with this newfound freedom? Farming. I could farm. If I stay in town long enough, I could see getting into the farm life. The problem with farms is the amount of poop. Like, even if you don't have animals, you actually buy poop or something and shovel it all over the place. It's madness. It's poop madness. Cool place to hang out. Bridge freezes before road. Welcome to Historic Possum Springs, original county seat of Deep Hollow County. You're not lost, you're here. Hmm, that's a weird thing to say. That's a weird slogan. After this, a few miles and you go under the highway. And it's just rolling fields and farms. I miss the corn mazes this fall. And the haunted barn in Brittle. Always next year. For campfire and corn dogs. Weird that town ends like, bam, right here. There's like a line somewhere that no one can see. But you can put it on a map. Hey, Selmers. You were great last night. Aw, oh, thanks. Having you to bounce ideas off helped. I'm good for that. Wanna hear a new poem? This is a short one. Because I'm tired. Me too, so that works out. <clears throat> I got mad one time. It was online. I've been mad on the internet before, too. It's crazy making. Oh, I thought that was part of the poem. <laughs> what were you doing at the library? I go to the library. No, but seriously. Wait, what was that? A 
play a mean banjo. Claw hammer. Really? I play bass. We should play together sometime. You know Long Black Veil? Yep. You know Tom Dooley? Yep. My dad likes that stuff. You know Willer Garden? Nope. Eh. Nah. Getting kind of cold, huh? Yeah, nip in the air at night. I like fall when it gets cold. Me too. Real pretty out as well. I used to cry at fall trees when I was a kid. Why? Because they were so pretty. Hmm. I did that when my daughter was born. You have a daughter? Yep. Where is she? Sorry. It was fine. G Greg? Oh. No, not Greg. Just made me think of Greg because they look sort of similar and they're playing with a crossbow just like we were. Hey, Jen. Hey, May Borowski? Yeah. What are you doing back here? Does Greg know you're back? Nah, just here for a day. Had to pick some stuff up from Greg's mom. Hauling back to school tonight. Ah. Didn't you go to school? What are you doing here? Ah, dropped out, kinda. Oh, sorry to hear that. Eh, whatever. What are you going for? I want to do fashion design. Is that a job you can get? Theoretically. You still go crossbow hunting? Greg still does. Kinda. Yeah, I still hunt rabbits and stuff. Nothing big. Don't get much chance at school. I was shooting at that tree over there. But I noticed there was a dude sleeping behind it. <laughs> Yeah, that is awfully close to where Bruce is. So I stopped. Oh yeah, that's Bruce. He's nice. I'm just glad I didn't accidentally put a bolt in his face. Oh yeah, that'd be bad. Well, it's nice seeing you. You still see Greg sometimes? Oh yeah, all the time. Well, tell that cousin of mine he needs to come see me out in Bright Harbor. Sure thing. See ya. Take it easy. Jen. Greg's cousin, okay? Hey, you free? Maybe. Wanna go on a quick adventure? Don't you have a job? Pastor's gone. I'm gonna skip out. Whoa. Quick adventure, huh? So this isn't gonna take up the full day then, right? Sure. Let's get work. Only I'm skipping work, hun. Oh, hush. I'm an accessory to the crime. Also, not a crime, sweetie. I don't think I've ever been up here. We used to come here all the time. Did we? No, we isn't my friends and I when we were your age. Oh, okay. I'm not used to use you using any other wees. Believe it or not, I've had several Wii's. Huh. This is nice. Used to be a lot more trees around up here. They got cut down when they put in the towers. I don't remember that. You know, what kinds of things happened before you were born? What? Some minor parts of history took place, yes. <laughs> so what is this place? Jenny's Field. Ever heard of it? No, I don't think. Back in the 30s, there was this woman and her daughter walking here. And the woman's daughter's in front of her. And then she's just gone. Like, disappeared. What happened? Turns out there was a sinkhole that opened up when a pillar collapsed in the mines in the hill. Jeez. Yep. No one could see it because of the grass. Her name was Jenny. This is Jenny's field. They never found her. Just... gone. 
So, wait, why are we here? What, you not up for a little risk taking? <laughs> ah! What's wrong? I thought it was a sinkhole thing. Hmm, how about that? Okay, what is that? For some reason, before Unify had pulled out, they brought this old lime furnace up on the mountain. Why? Who knows? Unify did a lot of things. Looks like it's been here forever. It's just sunk into the ground a lot. Like Jenny. But slower. We used to climb up there. Want to try? <laughs> oh, sweetie. I had you and also a lot of birthdays and donuts since then. And not much climbing. Alright, I'll do it. So, uh... Good thing this chimney is sealed up here. <laughs> yeah, good thing. What can you see up there? It's been a while. Uh, Balsam Springs and most of the valley. What does it look like? The quilt? Well, it's a cozy valley. I remember I couldn't tell if being up there made everything feel bigger or smaller. It's a weird feeling. Yeah, I know that one. I used to have a dream when I was your age where I was in the big parking lot out by the tracks, and I'd start running, but there was always more parking lot. Hmm. What do you think it meant? Uh, I don't know. Feels weird to tell you what your dreams mean. Why? You're my mom. Fair. Why did we come up here today? Well, I was hoping you'd fall into a sinkhole, obviously. That didn't work out. Drat. Guess I'll just have to keep you. I couldn't see what your expression was when you said that. Do you need to? No. Well, see you at home. Hey! <laughs> Little picture of us out in Jenny's field. Oh, hello. Got somebody up here. Playing the violin in a very dangerous place. Hey. Hello. I'm May. Hello, May. I'm Salim. Are you a busker? Are you busking? <laughs> this would be a very inefficient place to busk. Who's going to come up all the way here to give them money? What's busking? I don't know. I think it's when you play outside and people give you money. Are you going to give me money? No. Then I'm not busking. Cool. Ah, you're here too. Drawing something? Yeah, drawing a bad guy for a movie. Have you, like, filmed anything ever? I made a little movie with my phone, and I pirated some movie programs. It's real bad. I play bass real bad. How long have you been playing? Enough to be real, real bad. Alright, I'm off. See ya. Later. Hey, B. Hey, May. I think I'm gonna burn this place down. Oh, cool. But also, maybe it might have consequences. We could take the insurance money. And, like, not do this. What if you get caught? I saw a show where they caught someone doing that. You're going to burn this place down for me. Oh, cool. But also, maybe I'd go to jail? No, you have no motive. No one would suspect. So, work's not going well? Ugh. Okay, I'll actually do it. 
Please don't actually do it. Okay, fine. Did you want to check out the graveyard? Uh, let's go everywhere else first. So, I said I could, like, take you up to the park. You did indeed. You ready to go? Nah. So I've just realized that I can go into the apartment building. And uh, I can't do anything with the elevator, but I can go to the stairs? And I know I couldn't do that last time I was here. Oh. Oh. Uh, we've been up here already, right? I remember looking at that person down there who's reading the paper. Have we been over here? Probably. What the hell is a malt? I love how the sign bounces a little bit. Oh man, I want to get up there. Can I do it? Oh crap. Ah, oh, there's actually no need to try to jump to the left, because we can just jump up on this thing right here with a triple jump. Yeah, I don't think I've been all the way up here. Where does that go? Hella birds. <laughs> Playing music for them. Holy shit, that's a lot of birds. Uh, hello. Hello? I'm May. Sadie. What are you doing up here? What are you doing up here? Exploring. Same way I found it. Did you know this is the only stage in town? Are you on stage a lot? Nope. Not for a long time at least. Looks like no one's played here in a long time. Yeah, been a few decades. Are you gonna, like, put on something here? Well, I don't think anyone's gonna be putting anything on here. At least not anytime soon. No electricity, probably structurally unsound. Infested with rats and pigeons. Other than the electricity, that's like most of the town. <laughs> that it is. That it is. Funny. What? I just met this guy over by the church steps. He was also hanging by himself. And playing music. Small world. <laughs> well, small town at least. Definitely. See ya. Huh. Pentagram. I love that I just keep discovering new stuff, even in areas that I've already, like, mostly been to. You know, I've been across this... This bit of street down here so many times. And I've been across... This right here, but... Not a level up. Sup, kid? How's it snacking, Falcon? Just kicking it. Drank too much chocolate milk. And I was throwing up. Uh, when the light bulb delivery came. <laughs> what? I had to sign for it while puking. Jeez, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Just flew too close to the sun. The chocolate, milky sun. So what's up? Ah, so we just smash more light bulbs. And I already know that's not a full day thing, so that should be fine to do. Um, aren't I supposed to tell them about their cousin? Can't seem to do that here, though. Uh, smash some light bulbs? Let's see if I can do better this time. I hit like, what, one, maybe two lights before?
I was still waiting for that can or or glass, whatever. Yeah, that. Oh. I saw that one, but I was just a little bit too slow. Come on, throw another one. Come on, Greg. Out of bulbs. Wonder if we needed any of those. I mean, so they just Christina will order more. So they just keep getting shipments of bulbs and they're just destroying them. <laughs> Jeez, this is a magical place. Greg is so destructive. I mean, I am too. I agreed to do it, didn't I? Just saying hello. Cool. Do I know you? No. Oh. Aren't you Greg's cousin? You really look like his cousin. Uh, not his cool cousin, Jen. Like, the other cousin? No. Who are you then? Why are you here? I'm trying to find your city council. Town council. We're a town. Right. Well, why are you looking for them? Supposed to be demoing an infrastructure and municipal services management program. What? Helps you manage things like snow plows and broken hydrants and stuff. Oh, yeah, we have those sometimes. I just figured it'd be helpful. I don't know. Lots of places are just scared of new things. Just want to keep things like they are forever, falling apart. It's frustrating. You're really into this, huh? I mean, it's my job, so... I had a job. I bagged groceries. Could you program something to make that job not suck? Well, soon it's gonna... It's all gonna be robots anyway, so... Jeez, yeah. Huh. I got it! You're Donna's cousin! Yeah! She used to babysit me. Oh, wow! Are you the kid that killed a bird with her mace? Oh, God. It was an accident, and I was like nine. I thought it was perfume or something. I thought the bird would like it. Well, you are nine. It died, like, instantly. Just... Dead. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. Good luck. Try not to kill anything. No promises. Hey? Hey? What? Wanna hang out? I got plans later. Okay, well, I don't think you're gonna get kidnapped or anything. Okay, I know from last time that I said nah, and then I was never able to do it again. So this time I'm gonna say sure and hope it doesn't take up the whole day. Hop on my bike. Really? Where is it? Tied up behind the food donkey. I guess you could, like, run behind. Okay, fine. You sure your bike's gonna be safe? Yeah, I don't think anyone's been in that shed for years. I'm sorry you fell off. That's cool. I feel so alive. Scrapes are cool like that. I skinned my elbow. I can, like, ride you to the hospital. For this serious wound. Put the siren on. So what are we doing here? Do you trust me? Never thought about it before. Okay. Bye. See ya. <laughs> oh my god, germ! 
Oh, jeez, dude. Hey. What the hell, man? Jump, it's fine. Oh, for real? Dude, you scared me to death. Why? You jump off big stuff all the time. Yeah, but, like, that's in town. Nice flat ground. Not like I can just go jumping off cliffs and whatever. Oh, yeah, I forgot you grew up in town. So what are we doing here? I come here a lot. Wanted to show you something. You hang out at a sewer pipe? I mean, not exclusively. I saw like 10 rats down here, down here once. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, so... I started coming down here a few months ago to like, just hang. Okay. And I noticed, whoa! Oh, hey, Rabies! Ah! Rabies is my sewer friend. Its name is Rabies? His name is Rabies. His name is Rabies? I found him when they pulled that body out of here. After that big flood a few months ago. Oh, neat. He was sad and wet and hungry, so I brought him chips and ice cream. Sounds right. And I wanted the other possums to not pick on him. So I named them after something they're all afraid of. This is the best story ever. He's so rad. Hey, rabies. Speak. Ooh. Oh my god. He's gonna rule this whole ravine someday. You be nice to May, okay, rabies? I love him. You got any pets? Uh, not really. You should get one. My dad has a bird. That's a garbage pet. <laughs> Jeez, trash bird, garbage pet. Tell me about it. So there's like weird stuff on the walls in here. Ancient cave paintings. Not new at least. What do you think it means? Rabies is trash king. It's a prophecy. Written by ancient hobos. There's like all kinds of secret places like this around town. I'm like the only person to really map it. Hey, Rabies, what you got there? Oh my god. Is that a fiasco bar? You want me to unwrap that for you, guy? Holy effing crap. He is the best. You should take him home. No way, he'd peel over everything. And dig a hole in the wall and live there. Oh, yeah. Rabies is wild. Let him be wild. <laughs> Look, he's eating it. See ya. That was cool. No drive for rabies? I'm surprised. Just us falling off the bridge. How did he get over this thing? I can't jump that. No way, he could have. There's no hole. How did he do it? I mean, I guess he could really be a ghost. I think he's a ghost. Ugh. What's out there? Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're gonna head to the graveyard.